What's up my loves? Welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Angie Monique. So for today's video we played in some makeup trying some new makeup products. Some of these I picked up during the sale. Some of them I've just been holding on to and just have not gotten around to using them. But we used them today. Okay. We did use them today. I used a new primer, a new foundation, um, some new bronzers, a highlighter, mm -hmm. some new lip products. Y'all, I love it. This is what the face is giving. Uh-huh. She did that. She did that. But I'm not going to carry on too much longer. If you're interested in knowing what products I use, how they applied on me, all the specs, all the tea, as you can see, bars. This is the video for you. Come on. Let's go. Hey y'all, so I have a lot of makeup here in front of me. Um, not all of this, like I said in the intro, not all of this I got during the sale. Some of this I've just been holding on to and have not used it. So yeah, let's just play in some makeup. Let's try some new products. Let's do that. So, um, these are not new. These are the um, e.l.f. Glow Reviver Lip Oils. Really, really good. I got like, I think all the colors is for like the orange one or the coral one or something like that. But yeah, they're bomb. So, brows are done per usual. So, I have two foundations. Um, okay. No, I don't. Because the other one, I want to do a dedicated video on it. So, this here, I've had this. I did not pick this up during the sale. But this is the Makeup Forever HD Skin Hydro Glow Foundation. I've had this for quite a, quite a while. I got the mini one. And I picked mine up in the shade 4N62. This is what she looks like. She look a little light. Mm -hmm. She look a little light. But we gon' we gonna try this. So I have that. I have this new Fenty Beauty Demi Glow Light Diffusing Highlighter. This is what this one looks like. I picked mine up in the shade Java Jitters 09. So, first of all, this packaging is super, super cute. And this is what the product looks like. Yeah, so we got that. NYX came out with these Buttermelt Bronzers. I got two of them. I got the shade Butter Off and Butter Than You. So we're going to try these out. Um, I've had this for quite a while. This is the Danessa Myricks Beauty Yummy Skin Blurring Balm Powder for face and eyes. This is in the Universal shade. Yeah, I've heard great things about this, but like I said, I've just been holding on to it. I have not gotten around to using it. So, and y'all know I love Nessa Myricks, but this is what it looks like. So, we're going to prime with this today. Um, What else new I have? I'm trying to show you all the new products. I told y'all in the sale I picked up another Coco Naughty um, Sunstalker Bronzer by Fenty. Um, and then I also picked up these Huda Beauty Faux Filler Extra Shine Lip Glosses. I picked up two shades. I picked up Posh and I picked up the shade Coco. If you follow me on TikTok, you saw that I did a video regarding this one. And I love the formula. So I've already tried this. But I was eyeing this Coco shade. So I went back on the site and picked up the Coco shade. So yeah, I got both of those. Everything else, y'all, I think is pretty much going to be what I normally use. So, uh, let's just play in these new products. Alright. Alright. So, I don't like using my fingers. So, um, like I said, brows are done. So, I'm just going to take... I'm trying to see if I can just do this. Oh, okay. I can do this. Yeah. And it... I'm guessing we use it as a primer. I 
okay so let's hop into this foundation um like i said i got the mini one because i did not know how it was going to work on me um and i picked it up in the shade four and six two and i'm just going to take my flat top uh foundation brush from morphe to blend it out with but it comes with a little brush which is nice I just don't know how to or did it break did it did i break this or is this how it's supposed to be okay i don't know if this is broken or what and i may be putting too much on but i'm just trying to get enough to blend out and spread because they kind of look broke but who am i okay so this is what we're going to work with. I'm just going to get my mirror and we're going to blend this out. Not bad. It's not bad at all. I can work with this. It's definitely lightweight. It doesn't feel heavy on the skin it's extra liquidy not real liquidy but it's not thick at all let me say that it does give you that glow and it looks like it's like a medium coverage because y'all know i have this little mark here it covered it up a little bit but i can still see it which is fine Yeah, she extra glowy. So, let's see what this claims to do. Oh, it has hyaluronic acid in it. Okay. Okay, so it's good for uneven texture. Best for dry combo, normal skin. Um, natural finish, hyaluronic acid, hydrating. Medium coverage, which is good. Like, I can do, I can do a medium coverage that that works for me um it mimics the hydrating effect of a sheet mask okay so it says this skin boosting formula is inspired by skincare sheet masks and delivers 24 hour hydration it is ideal for dry mature and sensitive skin and also visibly improves skin's texture and radiance in as little as four weeks of use okay so the feather light texture melts into skin and it's buildable for added coverage. Okay, so you can build this up. I'm not going to do that because y'all know I am a medium coverage type of girl. So first impression, I'm not mad at this. I love the glow that it gives. So I really, really um, like that. This will probably be great for like fall and winter months. Um, if you powder really really good you can probably get away with using this during the summertime but i am an oily skin girl in the summer baby i just don't be wanting all that foundation and stuff on my face period so yeah i would definitely probably wear this more in the fall and winter months but so far so good let's move on no new concealers same old same old we're going to use our la girl Pro concealers in the shade Fawn. And then I'm also going to sit with my Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder in the shade Medium Deep. So we have the uh, NYX Butter Melt Bronzers. I have the shade Butter Than You. And then I have the shade Butter Off. So this is what they both look like next to each other. And I want to say these are the darkest two shades. So this looks hella dark. This looks hella light, but we gonna see. I'm gonna start with the hella light one first, cause y'all know sometimes when you think it's gonna be hella light, it can be real pigments itself. So I'm just going to okay. Wait, is this powder? It look like it's. Is it powder? Okay, I thought this was a cream product. So hold on. Okay, now we can try now we can try this out so i'm just so i just dabbed into it like that and i'm just going to okay yeah you see what i'm saying 
this is gonna be hella dark so the one i'm using is butter off so i'm glad i did start with the with that one but i kind of want to take a bigger brush and this is my i don't even know what brush this is i'm pretty sure this is from a uh, color pop or something yeah that's cute that's a cute little situation she's not too like she's giving sun kiss lightly sun kiss though so i'm not even gonna have to use my cocoa naughty because this is this is getting the job done and she's affordable she's affordable so new bronzer affordable bronzer the butter melt bronzer in the shade butter off really really nice liked it i liked it a lot so Mm-hmm. Okay. I haven't used my Juvia's Place Warriors palette in a minute. So I am just going to take a blending brush, go in my favorite shade, which is Kano, and put that in the crease. I have just been doing bronzer lately because, yeah, it's just easy and it's, it's good. Okay, you can also take like a more tapered brush, like a bullet brush, go into a little bit of Mino, which is like a darker brown. Put that in the outer V, like place it. And we're gonna take our blending brush and blend it out. That same blending brush and just blend it out. And you can move it up into the crease, but you're really just focusing it on it right here in the in the outer corner okay look cute situation okay no blush none of that I've set everything let's go in with eyeliner y'all already know my Fenty fly pencil in the shade cause I'm black that so i think i want to do since i've already tried the shade posh i definitely want to try the shade coco but i am going to swatch both of them for you very very pigmented uh, lip glosses um really really nice formula so yeah i am going to swatch both of them for you but i'm going to line my lips i think i'm going to take my lip liner my mac chestnut lip liner it needs to be sharpened too this is the shade so before before i do that let me spray my face so let's finish the face let me spray my face before i do the lips um even though we already lined them and then put on some mascara just a few new products y'all nothing too big nothing too you know over the top Can we get into um, how like 
what let's talk about these eyeshadow palettes like when's the last time you purchased an eyeshadow palette or you got excited about an eyeshadow palette that came out because I have not gotten excited about an eyeshadow palette so I don't know if I'm missing that on something so let me know down in the comment section below like is there a new eyeshadow palette that I need to be looking at that's you know I need to go get because Julius Place does it for me my bronzers do it for me y'all know this so And this is just my Urban Decay D Slick makeup setting. And this is oil control. So I love, love, love this one. And then I like to go over that with the uh, LYS Natural Finish. This is a skin loyal, this is the Skin Loyalty Blur Mattify and Set makeup setting spray. So I like to use both of these. Let's put on some mascara. I am going to take my Milk Kush mascara. I recommended this in my TikTok uh, Sephora recommendations video. Love, love, love this. One of my top three high-end uh, mascaras. Okay, so face is pretty much done. We're just going to jump into the lips. So these are the Huda Beauty Faux Filler Shiny Non-Sticky Lip Glosses. Totally agree with that. Non-sticky, but they are super pigmented. When I say pigmented, pigmented. If you're looking for a sheer gloss, these ain't it, okay? So, I tried the shade Posh already. They have one, two, three, seven shades. Um, Posh is considered... And Posh is actually sold out. It's considered a deep rose. Love the applicator. And this is... That's Posh. Super, super nice. Like, super, super nice. That is Posh. And then the color that we're going to use today, because I've already tried Posh, is Coco. This is the one that I was like, yeah. I need that. I need that. I need that. I need that. I'm just a gloss girl. But yeah, that is what Coco looks like. So we're going to put on Coco. I line my lips with my MAC um, lip liner in the shade Chestnut. So let's just apply this. Uh huh. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah. Look at. Look at that. Ugh. Look at that. So juicy. So pigmented love it absolutely love it okay i missed the products we did not try the java jitters uh this is the shade in the fancy beauty demi glow we finna try this because i want to see what she's talking about i want to see so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna take a bronzer brush a clean one and we're gonna use it going to yeah just do it like that and oh oh <laughs> yes are y'all seeing that they look so good oh my god I need to I need to find somebody to go I need a day. Oh. Look at that. Look at that. But. I need to find somewhere to go. Y'all. I love everything that I use today. 
very rare very rare i know very rare but y'all the face looks really really good very natural i don't feel like i have a whole lot on my face y'all know i am a medium coverage girl i don't like to feel thick gulky makeup on my face i just don't like to do that i don't like to feel it and that's not what i get with this uh where i go with this hydro glow foundation really really nice the shade really really good these really really good i use the shade again butter off absolutely love this gonna get used baby gonna get used baby these faux filler glosses if you don't have any if you don't if you did not get any during the sale i'm so sorry but go ahead and get you a few like i said posh is out of stock but they have a clear one they have cocoa is still in stock they have a few other shades so go get you some of these glosses i may get a couple more of their shades like i said i think they have like six or seven but i got two what else y'all i think that's it i am loving the face i'm loving it i loved everything that i tried um but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you've tried some of these products let me know down in the comment section below what you tried what you've liked what you don't what you didn't like don't like whatever sent back taken back let me know down in the comment section below but yeah this is the face this is what she's giving for today yeah i can appreciate it i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did as always give it a thumbs up like comment subscribe and share and of course i'll see you guys in the next video